Thank you. I'm West. I'm a certified practitioner in the Ewing Method. I'm also a certified instructor. And I'll be directing Dr. Ewing's seminar this weekend here in Las Vegas at the Renaissance Hotel, Friday, Saturday, Saturday and Sunday. Um, I met Dr. Ewing in 2004, March 2004, six years ago this month. And I met him because I was very sick. I used to be a chemist. And I got very sick working with chemicals on my job to the point where I was disabled for eight years. For eight years, I couldn't leave my house without getting sick. And I was sick all the time in my house. Um, I couldn't work. I couldn't think. I couldn't eat what I wanted. I couldn't do what I wanted. And I was always sick. I was, uh, at the point I met Dr. Ewan, I was seeing doctors two to three times a week. I was getting IVs of different things. I was taking about 80 to 100 different pills a day. And that was a combination of nutritional supplements, homeopathics, and pharmaceuticals. And that was just enough that I could get up and move. Searched all over the world for something to make me well. Found a few things to make me better, but nothing to make me well. Finally heard about Dr. Ewan, and I said, wow, Here's something maybe I could learn how to help myself. And I looked him up, I saw that he had a workshop, a seminar within driving distance of me. At that point in time, I had a special van that I redesigned so that I could travel if I needed to because I couldn't stay in hotels too sensitive to the chemicals that they used. So I have a van with a hardwood floor, big panel panel walls, but and cotton seats. It has its own air protection system. We call it the Enviro van. <laughs> so I piled all of my pills and appliances and everything into my Enviro van and took off to meet Dr. Ewan. Cried the whole way there because of how bad I felt. When I got there, I found out he was also offering private appointments. And I said, well, that's interesting. Maybe I should try a private appointment with this guy and see what he can do for me. How much? At that time, he was charging $400 for one hour. And I said, 400 bucks. Who is this guy who wants 400 bucks for one hour at this time? At that point in time, I was laying out about $1,000 to $1,500 a month in out-of-pocket medical expenses. And I was thinking, how many times am I going to have to spend this 400 bucks? How many times am I going to have to come back and see this guy? What could he possibly do for me in one hour? Finally, I signed up for that appointment based on the thought of, well, if it doesn't work, at least I can say I meant the kind of food guy. <laughs> So it turned out to be the best $400 I ever spent because one hour later, for the first time in eight years, I did not have any more pain in my body. And right there, all the doctor's appointments stopped, all the special diet, all the 80 to 100 pills a day, and the 1,000 to 1,500 out-of-pocket medical, it all stopped right there. And I said, okay, that's cool. That's worth knowing. I want to do that. That is why I do what I do. So, Dr. Cam Ewan. 35th generation Shaolin Grand Master in Chinese Kung Fu. Mr. Kung Fu of North America at the age of 27 years old, a structural engineer who worked for Lockheed Aerospace Corporation, a doctor of chiropractic, and a commissioned colonel in the International Police Force. Please welcome Dr. Kim Yun. Great to have you tonight. Uh, welcome. So, great for me to be here at this uh, martial arts school. So, I've been in martial arts uh, for a long time, so the reason I want to talk about it so long. Right? So, that's part of history. So, actually, uh, this method was actually we call the ultimate come through. So, you can do a lot of things with it, and it can make the training so much easier and get results so much quicker because you know about your stuff. That's what the martial arts all about. It's all about yourself. So you can strengthen yourself, you can have more endurance, you can have more speed, you can just make yourself functioning uh, like the animal would function. Right? Without a thinking mind that's sabotaging. So and um, I don't want to deal with any health problem because people usually don't have health problems. They think they do. And then they pay someone else to tell them that they have a health problem. Right? So 
And if they tell you you have a health problem, and it was true, uh, whatever they tell you if it's true, it would resolve your problem, right? So essentially, that's what it is. So uh, some of you have written down a few things here, and uh, then if they are born, you would have, with my lecture, I would just show you what could be done, right? And um, you can do things with your thought, but you still want to get your mind out of the way, right? Because your mind sabotages you all the time. So to sabotage you so much, the body expects the mind to sabotage uh, itself any second. Okay. So, Julia from Pennsylvania or Damascus. That's not a good Jewish. I mean, not Jewish. Damascus, Syria, Pennsylvania. Yeah, okay. Anyway, so we have some pain since uh, December. It's worse at night. So, you have pain now, basically? No, it is. It's, it's your jaw. If I had gone, I would feel it. Does it bother you? It's gone, okay? I can feel it. It makes all sorts of noises. Okay. So, if the noise bothers you, then you don't want to be bothered by the noise, right? Yeah. So, uh, it's just not normal. <laughs> so, how it bothers you? How does that noise bother you? Oh. How does it upset you? Um, and actually, I, nothing seems to bother me much these days, but it, it seems okay. like it shouldn't be there. Okay. And so I'm thinking, okay, it's time to okay. let it go. See, the thing is, it's not coming from the jaw, it's coming from another part of your body, okay? So it's just going to strengthen another part of your body. But you have a weakness here in your hip, in your foot, your left foot, and then your left hand, okay? So now if I strain those weaknesses, now what's that feel like to you? Jaw, which I think about the other parts. Really? You can get jaw on the other parts. Now, what's that feel like? Much better. It takes difference, right? Much louder, yeah. All right, so that's why you don't want to spend any money on health care, right? That's why the whole country going to grow. Because <laughs> people are spending money for something that don't get better in, right? So, you want to have health care insurance? Why don't you just have fitness insurance? And relationship insurance? Yeah. Prosperity insurance, right? Forget about health insurance, right? So you need to be part of that revolution, okay? To change what's going on. 